What is up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you guys the uh, new VIP Prestige 6 that just came out. I am pretty stoked about it. It um, looks pretty cool. There's not really any big changes in it, but uh, in terms of what it does offer, it's it's mainly like attack boosts and defense boosts and they're like advertising the health boost that, that comes with it, but they're not in crazy, but they are uh, they are sizable and Pretty stoked to see those, um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what level 1 offers. First thing, I just want you guys to see, this is level 1. Um, <laughs> that's a lot of points. I haven't finished putting in all my points yet that I have saved up. Um, but I just wanted to make this video and throw it out there quick for you guys, so I decided to stop. So we're just going to quickly look at, I want you guys to keep an eye right here on the, on the amount of points needed. 2.84, level 5, 6.42 million, 12.87 million, 23 million, 37.3 million, 56 million, and 80 million. It's really funny because just yesterday, me and my girlfriend were actually in the car talking about, because I have her hooked on Mobile Strike now, we talk about that a lot, so she, yeah, we were talking about, we were like betting on what the, oh, we weren't really betting, we were just saying, like joking around what the over under was on um, the amount of points to get to the next VIP prestige level 10. And um, I said over under 10 million points <laughs> and we both said over, but we didn't expect that. My God, uh, 80 million points is it's basically 80 million gold. If you're going to buy it with gold, which is like crazy. But um, anyways, I, I don't know what to say. You can't really do anything about it, you know, but, um, all right, so the first thing I'm going to be showing you guys is level one, um, and I'm going to be comparing this to level one and level ten of the VIP Prestige five, level one and ten. So, um, for VIP Prestige five, level one, the only real differences I notice are um, it has troop health is going to be troop health. At level one, the VIP Prestige five was twenty six percent, and it's twenty nine percent at level one. And um, at level ten of VIP Prestige five, so this one right here that you guys can't see on the side, neither can I. But um, it's it's twenty nine. So basically, you're, they're starting you off higher than the previous level was. So yes, if you don't have enough points to bump up a few levels or whatever, you should just go ahead and bump up to this prestige for those of you guys that are wondering that um, you can still do all of these these features that you could in VIP prestige 5 level uh, level 10 um, I don't think it had a huge defense boost it is a little bit of a drop in the defense because I believe it was level or 6% um, before Hmm. Hmm. I have to look into that more. But um, unfortunately, the deployment speed at um, level ten of VIP Prestige five was forty percent, and they're starting you off at thirty-six percent, which is not a huge deal, but it's definitely gonna. Um, ultimately be higher. I want to say that it should be higher than the 40% that the previous level 10 was. Yeah, it's 2% higher at level 10, so it's kind of nice, but um, this is pretty much the main feature that this comes with. When, once you get to level 10, you can see that it's not here at level at level 9, but um, this one has autocomplete 10 help. So if you start a building or research and you press that help button, you're automatically going to start with 10 of those. If you're headquarters 21, you're automatically going to start with 10 of the 25 but um, even if you, even if you're level six, I think that would be mean you automatically get all ten. I mean, I don't think there's any level six bases out there really. But um, yeah, guys, the um, right now I'm gonna just be comparing the level ten of this prestige to the level ten of the previous prestige. So um, the uh, auto alliance helps. That's new. Troop attack bonus. The previous troop attack bonus was 39%, so that's a 3% boost. Let's see. Troop health bonus. 
the previous health bonus was 29% and this is 37%. That's an 8% boost. That's kind of a big deal, you know. Um, let's see. Troop defense. Previous bonus was... Let me look here. I believe it was 29%. I'm not, I'm not exactly sure on that, guys, but um, it is higher than the previous one, I can tell you that. But um, all of these are pretty much the same. This is the 2% higher, like I said. Um, this is actually 3% higher, manufacturing research. Actually, you know what? It was actually 30, yeah, so 3% higher. Uh, this is the same as the previous level 10. Um, commander speed research, that was 13 as well, so that's 3 not really a whole lot of differences. They bumped this up a little bit. Um, you get a lot of missions. They really bumped up the VIP per, uh, mission bonus, and you get a 30% manufacturer speed, uh, research speed, or manufacturing speed bonus, which is cool. This is a total of 40 bonus missions, so that's pretty, pretty cool. Um, yeah, that's. Oh, I'm sorry. That's 48. So that's kind of a big deal. Um, I'm show you guys what each one offers from level one. You go here and they're kind of advertising that troop defense bonus and then they're bumping up troop health and then troop health a little bit too, bumping up that. Um, troop Q, they bumped up one notch, 37. Went deployment speed didn't bump up. I don't know why they advertised it like that, but that one bumped up another percent too. Health. Um, troop attacks at 39 and 29 defense. Um, Cost reduction, normal equipment, that's kind of cool. Manufacturing speed research, prototype irrigation, this is going to be kind of a big deal in the future. Daily missions bonus, I don't exactly remember how many they offered in the last one. I don't have all of the stats uh, for me to look at right now, I just have screenshots of them, but um, yeah, that is, that's quite a few missions, 17 extra ones. The VIP mission bonus, I don't think that they really had any uh, major boosts on the VIP missions until this level, so that's kind of cool. And then you, we already looked at this one, guys, so um, yeah, I'm pretty stoked about this. It's 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 cool, and um, we posted something on the blog about it. Let's take a look here. Yeah, right here. So you can see what they offered. General, the brand new VIP Prestige 6 is now available. Finish off all 10 levels of VIP Prestige 5. So you can move on to VIP Prestige 6. The perks of this higher VIP status grants are definitely worth the effort. Gain a huge health bonus to all normal and advanced troops. Automatically apply 10 alliance helps when starting a research or construction. Improvements to just about every, elements of your every element of your base's operations. Earn this new level of rewards and you'll feel like a real VIP. Nice, EW. That's real classy right there. I like that. <laughs> Watch out for special sales fit for Mobile Strike's top brass. Good luck climbing that ladder, Striker. Stand by for further instructions out. So, um, yeah, you guys can see there's um, the pack right now. Let's go ahead and look at that. The pack that's up right now has 635,000 gold. And it has, let's see, 1 million. That's 4 million. So 5 million. 2 million. That's 7 million. Um, So it has 8 million VIP points. That's not much. That means you'd have to buy, at least right now, you'd have to buy 10 of these packs to, to get it maxed out. But um, it usually starts out like that. Um, just like the headquarters level 22 did. I'm sure that they're going to be bumping that up more so in the uh, near future. So we should be seeing some nice increases in those pack sizes with the um, in terms of VIP points that they're giving. Um, I wouldn't be surprised to see even the next pack come with maybe even a little more than the 8 million points, but um, what I've found is that um, a lot of the a lot of the points that I've earned in the past for these VIP levels are, th are points that I've bought in with gold, so that's kind of going to be a, a, a big way to boost your VIP too, and um, like I did in that video a while back when I, actually it was one of my uh, newer, or my one of my oldest videos and I um, talked about how using 
loyalty points is definitely a good way to get some. I mean, I have 425 million VIP points right now. So, I mean, yeah, it doesn't like buying those hundred at a time. It doesn't really make a big difference. But when you're buying that many, it's going to be making pretty big leaps. So <laughs> it's just going to be a pain to add all those up and um, <laughs> click use over and over and over and over. But uh, that's what auto clickers are for. But yeah, guys, um, I think I'm going to wrap this up. I just wanted to kind of show you guys that, um, give you my opinion on it. It's not bad. I wasn't expecting really any more or any less. So those combat stats are going to be kind of cool. But um, yeah, guys, I think that's about it. So um, please hit that like button down below. It helps me out. Um, and comment any questions below and subscribe. All right. Thanks for watching, guys.